Hi everyone, this is a quick little video. Um, it is yarn related, but it's not any of my parcels. I um, I stopped at Spotlight on the way home just to see if they refilled the Millen's bag, uh, bins and they had, and I was looking, I saw them at the front, I'm like, oh, that's a bit weird. So I was looking through them and another lady walked past me, she goes, you know, there's two more down there. I'm like, don't tell me that. So, um, they were also on special for $7 each. They're normally $10 each. So I got a few. So I got three. No, I didn't. I got four of this green. Take it out. So I'm not sure on brands or anything because they never obviously put that on there. But it 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 feels like it's in acrylic. Um, so there's some grey, um, a lighter blue, a green. So I thought this would make a really nice poncho. I actually might use this instead of one of the other yarns that I was going to use for um, Crystal's Bag -a Day Crochet, her new um, shawl pattern. So that's, I got four bags of that, so that will be more than enough. They're all 400 gram bags. Then I spotted this and I'm like, it is really difficult to try and get a nice orange in acrylic. So, and this kind of, it looks very similar to like a red heart type feel. Um, but let me try and open it. So it's actually softer than red heart though. But yeah, it's like perfect shade of orange. So, um... I picked up that one. I also got two bags of this cotton. Um, I don't know um, brands, obviously, but um, there's a like a um, light pink and a red, and I want to make some dishcloths with this. So. And one of the most exciting finds, and I believe that these are the bobbin yarns. I think it's, is it Premier that bought those out? I think that's, I don't know. When I saw this, I just about died. I'm like, no. Um, I looked through the bins to see if I could find any more, but I could only find this one. Um, so there's been mixed reviews about them. I'm gonna try and get one out. Um, I like that it does have. Oh, that was a bad idea. <laughs> I'm gonna have to like recake it or something. But um, yeah, it feels really, really soft. Um, I think. Oh my gosh. Um, the only issue, honestly, probably would be. Um, because it's not wound, it's not wound, because it's not spun um, tightly, it may split, but I was just so excited to find one. Um, and I'm gonna have to sort it out at some stage. But yeah, I was excited to find those because they've only like literally just come out in the States. So I was very surprised to see that in a million bag. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to nab those and I saved $24. So um, yeah, I got eight bags of Millen's yarn um, for $56. So I thought that was an amazing deal. Um, obviously I've still got my mandala cakes that I got. You guys know what it's like, right? So, um, yeah, but the the delivery that I missed today, if I had it came straight home from work instead of going to Spotlight, I would have got it. But I ordered myself a treadmill because I want to lose weight and get healthy. And the weather has been really crappy here lately. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to bite the bullet. It's, it wasn't expensive. It was like under $500. But um, I was like, you know what, I want to get myself one. So I'll probably end up moving. Sorry, I've got the heater on and the... It, because it's a brick building, it creaks and cracks and all that stuff. Um, yeah, so I'll probably end up moving my couch over a bit um, to to fit it in. But they're going. I've 
ask them to re-deliver it on Thursday. So I'm hoping they deliver it at the same time. I have given them authority to leave it, which I don't know if that's a good idea, but anyway, um, I'm hoping that they will um, <clears throat> leave, like deliver it at the same time. Um, cause tomorrow I would have had them re-deliver it tomorrow, but I've swapped shifts with, um, one of the girls at work. She needed to do an earlier shift. So I don't finish till quarter past five. So I'm like, eh, I don't really want to, um, get them to re-deliver it tomorrow because I'll be home later. So hopefully they re-deliver it at the same time. Um, cause there was no, they should, what they should have is an option on there as well to select what time you want it re-delivered. Um, but they didn't have that on there. So, but yeah, I just thought I'd pop on and share that little yarn haul with you. Um, <clears throat> I do, do still have my ice yarns coming, little order and my order from Hobby. Honestly, they've like cut like the postal system by half like people who sort the mail and stuff like that. So it's taking a lot longer to get our packages. Um, I was expecting the one from Hobby to be actually be here today. On the tracking information, it says by tomorrow, but the tracking hasn't changed since it was in Melbourne the other day. So I don't know, no idea. So yeah, I will let you know what I think of this mess when I start to use it but um yeah I hope you guys are all doing well and I will see you in the next video bye